All right there, boys and girls, back at it again. And today I've got another really good one for you. Today we're gonna take a look at my Arai Corsair X Nakagami 3 helmet, also known as the Nakagami GP3 in other parts of the world. Now this is the race replica helmet for Taka Nakagami, who rides for LCR Honda Itamitsu in MotoGP. Um, Taka Nakagami has been riding for Honda on the LCR Itamitsu team since 2018. LCR is the Lucio Cecinello racing team. Now there's uh, Taka's teammate is Alex Marquez and Alex rides for the LCR uh, Honda Castrol team. And then the Itamitsu team is the uh, pretty much the Asian sponsored team. Um, Taka used to be in the 125 CC World Championship from 2007 until 2009. Um, he had zero wins and zero podiums. Uh, he was in Moto2 for uh, quite a bit. He was um, from 2011 and 2017. Uh, first with the Ital Trans Racing Team from 12, 2012 to 2013, and then uh, the Hidemitsu Honda uh, Team Asia from 2014, 2017. Um, he had two wins uh, with the Itamitsu Honda Team Asia. Uh, he had one win in 2016 in Assen, and then he had a win in Silverstone in 2017 in the Moto2 class. And then he got brought up to MotoGP in 2018, riding a year old bike on the LCR Itamitsu team. And his teammate was um, Cal Crutchlow, and up until, um, you know, last year uh, when Mark got injured and Cal got injured, Cal left. Cal is now the Yamaha uh, test rider and uh, Alex Marquez got demoted from the Repsol Honda team to the LCR Castrol Honda team. Anyway, um, Nakagami, no wins in MotoGP, no podiums, one pole position last year and he crashed out on the first lap of that race but going back to what i've been saying uh recently in a bunch of my videos uh as always in typical arrive fashion these guys knock it out of the fucking park with their helmet designs for japanese riders this helmet is gorgeous if you see photos online it's really hard to do it justice um this helmet is gorgeous now what i like about it most it's it's a pearlescent metallic paint. I really like it. Unlike the other recent uh, Japanese rider helmets uh, that I've made videos of recently that I have, the Nakasuga 2, that's a frost helmet. That's that purplish one with the cat um, on the background. The Tatsuki Frost that came out this year, gorgeous helmet, fucking stunning, but it's a frost. Um, but I do like the Japanese artwork design on that. Uh, the Kianari Frost, that's the one with the dragons. A lot of frost, um, even the, uh, uh, the, the other uh, Takumi Frost one, which I didn't make a video of that. I do not have that uh, helmet. But this Nakagama 3 helmet is really, really gorgeous helmet. Pearlescent paint, metallic where it needs to be. And I really like this tile mosaic um, that he's got going on here. There's some subtleties where the, um, the clover leaves and Takanakagami's number 30 fade in and out. I like how up on the top, you could see the, sorry, the number 30 here in the, in the yellow kind of fades when you move it around a little. Uh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous helmet. I have it with the blue mirrored visor on. Um, the most subtle detail about this helmet uh, which I like the most is the spoiler made to look as the Japanese flag looks stunning metallic paint in that really 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 amazing job with this helmet it's got the metallic in all the right places um, I love the symmetry in the back between the colorations I like the gold wreath really really gorgeous colorways here um, they use the metallic in all the right spots Again, this is a really, really nice helmet. You have to see this one in person to really appreciate it. 
the photos online do not do it justice. When I got it, I was very, very pleasantly surprised. Um, I liked it because the detail, the mosaic, little tiles, the cool colors. It's got purple, it's got orange, it's got green. It's got the blue, the yellow. It, it doesn't match anything, but it doesn't clash with anything. It's, it really can just go with any bike if you're just a fan of racer replica helmets. By far and away, this is the best helmet by any Honda rider this year. So Paul Espargaro, he's got that uh, HJC contract. His logo is a wolf. I'm not a big fan of his helmet. Mark Marquez, I liked his um, the Black Concepts 2.0 helmet from Shoei, and which I have, gorgeous helmet, but he doesn't wear that to race. Um, he's wearing his new uh, signature design for this year, which is not a mat. And then Alex Marquez also is sponsored by Shoei. I do not like his helmet that much, but this thing is gorgeous. Best helmet for any Honda rider on the MotoGP grid. Just love the details, little nuances, the number 30s, little translucence um, effect to them. They kind of fade and, and shine brighter. Really like the number 30 right here. And I do like how that is a little asymmetrical. Once again, for an Asian, uh, sorry, for a Japanese rider, a Rai knocks it out of the park. They do this all the time. Other, other riders don't get all the, the attention and the, and the design and the details. This is another YF design, gorgeous. Just a stunning helmet. It's different, it pops. The yellows, the blues, the bits of orange really just pops and makes it uh, really stand out. Just a gorgeous helmet all around. You know, the Corsair X is a rise top of the line race helmet but great for track day riders, but this is all day comfort. You can ride this every day and uh, it would just really hold up really well. Just love the amount of vents in it. And even the detail and the fluorescent paint there, just in the vents here. So you close those and get those back open. Just gorgeous, really nice helmet. If you're in the market, uh, for a race helmet or a track day helmet or any type of helmet, you can't go wrong with the Arai Corsair X. And if you're looking to get something that's a little different than what most people have, definitely check out this Nakagami 3 graphic. It is a stunner and in person it looks really amazing. It's that mix between pearlescent metallics and then non-pearlescent colors. The gold just really goes well. It's got a nice metallic shine to it. The wreath in the back is gorgeous. The little mosaic tiles, almost looking like stained glass. That's what it kind of has the uh, look to me. It's just, it's like a stained glass window. Just a gorgeous helmet. Definitely take a look at this one if you're in the market. And um, yeah, like I said, a ride knocks it out of the park for Japanese riders. They just pull out all the stops and they make sure these graphics just look sick with the nuance, the detail, the subtleties, and even this effect right here. You know, that's just super nice. There's a tile in it, or there's a piece of clover leaf. You know, it's a tile, it looks a little ghosted. Um, with the shading, just so nice, so nice. Ride Corsair X Nakagami 3. As always, stay fresh.